This video demonstrates the mounting options and other accessories for the Apex sealed splice closure. Cable preparation lengths for Apex vary by cable and application. Refer to the written instructions or Apex cable length table located at aflglobal.com forward slash Apex. The recommended tools for the Apex closure are basic cable tools and a can wrench plus all locally required safety equipment. Items covered in this video are mounting Apex to strand with cable spacers, mounting strand with Apex strand hanger bracket, using pole or wall mounting bracket, Apex multi-port sealing kit for up to four per cable port. The Apex closure dome is designed to be strap mounted to the strand using single or multiple cable spacers and strap. Apex domes have mounting locations on both sides of the dome. The mounting insert will show the proper orientation of the basket. It is recommended to strand mount Apex with the basket in the lowest position. Place the mounting insert in the upper position when attaching cable spacers. Using the same method for orientation with the mount insert on top, attach strand mount brackets which puts the basket at the bottom of the Apex closure. Each kit comes with two strand brackets and two retention straps. Set strand brackets in the same orientation on the closure dome and ensure the mount insert is installed in the mounting tabs. Open the retention strap and wrap it around the closure and feed it through the opening in the strand bracket. Ensure the length rests properly between the lower tabs. Secure the strap. Repeat with the second strap, making sure both brackets are installed in the same orientation. Hang apex on the strand and secure strand mount bracket to strand. The pole or wall kit is designed to be mounted to the wall or pole and have the apex closure installed on the bracket as stated in step two. Using the mounting diagram, mount the brackets at the proper distance and orientation for the specific apex closure. Ensure the locking ring does not interfere with the mounting insert. Lift the apex closure up and slide the upper pole mount bracket tab into retention slot. Bring the base of apex toward the pole so the locking ring clears the lip on the bottom pole bracket. Align the mounting insert with the lower pole bracket and secure supplied bolt through bottom bracket into the apex insert. Tighten the bolt and lock washer. Each port of Apex is able to utilize the four cable multi-port kit for low fiber count, small diameter or flat drop cable. Each kit ships with tie wraps, blank plugs and the multi-port kit. Install in the cable attachment unit as a single cable would be installed. Preload the multi-port grommet with cable ties as shown. All four positions must be filled in this kit with either cable or blank plugs. Wrap the bundle with electrical tape where the hose clamp and spur bracket retain the cables.
Once all cables are secure, install in the cable attachment unit. The rods on flat drop are not retained and can be cut flush. Secure any strength rods under the central strength member retention screw. Be careful not to trap or kink fiber tubes. Tighten the central strength member retention bolt with the can wrench. Install the hose clamp in the proper orientation and begin to snug the hose clamp. Install the spur bracket in the proper orientation. Tighten the hose clamp to secure drop cables. Install in the base.